I mentioned is the differences between VC clinic and VC messenger. So a lot of people ask like, you know, like what are the differences? How do I use it? So for VC clinic, it's a workflow product. You know, you have your waiting room, you can turn on your scheduling, e-payment, et cetera. So that's a workflow product. And then once you purchase a VC clinic, it comes with a VC messenger. Like I showed you earlier, you can download the VC messenger uh, app for video calling. Uh, but if you are using the VC clinic, VC messenger is a part of it. You can use it or, you know, you can just use a web calling browser. It's up to you. Uh, you don't really need to use a VC messenger. So if you only have the VC messenger, oh, sorry. If you only have the VC messenger, it's just a video calling software. So it doesn't have the waiting room. It does not uh, have like scheduling. So, you know, like any like, you know, Facebook messenger or Skype, you do need to add each other in your, you know, phone address book. So meaning that, you know, you need to invite your patients and then they need to add you. So you are giving your email addresses, which is a VC messenger ID you are exchanging the email addresses to each other, then they will add you in their phone address book and then they can call you anytime. So if you're not comfortable giving out your email address, then VC clinic is the way to go because like, you know, they only know your clinic URL. From there, they can enter the waiting room and then you are the one who initiates a video call. So, you know, you are not giving out your personal information like your phone number or your email addresses. But you know, to call your family member or to call your coworkers, you can definitely use a VC messenger. Just add to the address book. All right, so differences. Yeah, no privacy to use a VC messenger. You will be exchanging the email addresses and then you cannot see the patient queuing. And then, you know, they can ring you anytime they want uh, in the VC messenger. But for some people, uh, you know, they provide a concierge service. Uh, their patients or their clients can call them anytime they want. In that case, uh, VC Messenger is good enough. You can just add them and then you can use it. 